Hi guys, it's Darlene and welcome to my channel. All right, so today I am reviewing a lip product. So what I thought I would do is each month pick a product that um, I like in a line. Uh, for instance, uh, today it's a product by Mally. Uh, one of my 2017 favorites was her lip gloss. It's the H3 lip gloss and it is wonderful. The H3 stands for hydrating, hydrating, hydrating and it does do that. It is beautiful colors, beautiful pigment. It's not gloppy, uh, it stays on uh, fairly well for lip gloss and it is very hydrating to the lips. So because I love that product, I said, well, let's try another product from Mally, something new. So today we are going to try the Mally Pure Pigment Melting Lip Powder. And she only has four colors and they come in duos. So this particular one has the color Mellow Mauve and Gentle Pink see there and this one has soft nude and tender rose so let's go ahead and I have nothing on my lips um, I did have a lip balm on but I have wiped that off so let's go ahead and I'm going to start with the soft nude and tender rose so we'll go ahead and start with these colors All right, so the first one is the Soft Nude. I'm gonna do these unlined, and then the very last one, I will line my lips and see if that makes a difference. This is what the color looks like. This is what the bottle looks like. When you open it up, it has sort of a doe foot applicator, and you can see that it is a powder. So let's go ahead, and we'll go ahead and swatch this so you guys could see. So the swatch looks nice. It looks like a nice nude. I'm gonna bring you in. And we're gonna try this one out. Okay. All right. I have a little mirror so I can see. Okay, so first impression, it goes on um, kind of cold, feels a little bit cold. And then it is a powder. Um, I do not like it at all. Uh, it looks drying to the lips. I'm gonna bring you in very, very close and I'll show you what I mean. So you could see pretty much every line in my lips. And being that I'm over 50, I don't wanna see every line in my lips. I need things that are hydrating. This is definitely not hydrating. I like the color. It's a nice nude, a nice neutral. That's fine. But um, no. And it, the pigment is very splotchy. It's just, it's not smooth. It's not, on the arm it looks, fine uh, but my I bet if I made a bigger swatch that it would have that um, just it's not it's very uh, patchy you know don't like it at all as far as how fast does it dry pretty good and you really can't see it appears that it it does stay on very well uh, that's right. <laughs> Let's go ahead and try another color. I'm going to see if you can actually put a second coat on and, and see. So let me go ahead and do that. bad it it's doing that thing where okay <laughs> you cannot layer this 
I'm gonna bring you in. And it's doing this thing where it's actually showing a line, like a demarcation line as to where you have the product. So let's take this off. We're going in with Tender Rose, which is this color here. Let me swatch it for you guys. Here's the color. Go ahead and... Oh, man, this stuff is just drying as sin. And you could see even doing the swatch, it's very blotchy. I don't think this is going to go well. I'm going to shake it and see if maybe that will help in some way. I don't know why that would help, but I really want this to work. Okay, I'm bringing it a little bit. Let's try this again. And it's just flying everywhere, and I'm wearing black. Oh. <laughs> I hate this. This, okay, guys, I don't give up on a lot of things, but boy, I'm telling, it just literally blew in my eye. This is horrible. This is, I can't talk and put it on. It blows everywhere. Okay, I have to give up. I'm going to, I'm going to pull you in and I'm going to show you why because it's it, mm, horrible. I'm going to do the other two colors for you. Just, maybe we have a bad box. Right, so let me go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and put on Mellow Mauve and Gentle Pink. I'm gonna do it here for you. And um, let me go ahead, I'll swatch them real quick. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch these colors and then we'll go ahead and put them on. Goodness gracious. Okay, so we've got the Mellow Mauve here. This is Mellow Mauve right here. And then we've got Gentle Pink. Yes, gentle pink. Oh. Even when I swatch them on my arm, guys, I'm gonna bring you in again. Are you getting dizzy from all the, all the zooming? Look at this. You could see the, the fallout of it, and yet it's just, they're splotchy just terrible and this one's been on a while so I'm gonna see if I can rub it off it's supposed to be long wearing um, I think that they probably would be very long wearing um, so I put the other two colors on you could see them there here I would love nothing more than to say this was an awesome product because I really hate giving bad reviews but this is probably the worst lip product I've ever tried just terrible I love Mally and I do I love her products I love her hydrating age 3 lip gloss it's my favorite in fact let's see if I put the lip gloss over this terrible lip powder if something magical happens hold on let's take one of Mally's lip glosses and here they are here in case you haven't seen my review on uh, the Mali H3 lip glosses, these are awesome. Isn't the packaging so cute? And let's go ahead, since we sort of have a pinky color on, we will take Orchid Berry, which is this right here. Sort of a pinky tone. This is what it looks like. Now let's go ahead and put this over. Okay, it looks a hundred times better. Her lip gloss could fix almost anything, but it feels really thick on because I do have the powder. Let's bring you in and just show you the difference. The lip gloss could just about save any color. I love these lip glosses. So what are my thoughts on the Mali Pure Pigment Lip Powder Duos? I'm just what I think about them. 
If you guys want to try a Mali product, I would definitely recommend the Mali H3 lip glosses. Phenomenal. These are fabulous. Look, it saved my lips from the torture that they just went through with the, the lip powder pigment. Oh. All right, guys, that's my final. As always, if you are subscribed to my channel, I just want to say thank you so very much. And if you are not yet subscribed and these videos are of interest to you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And I will talk to you guys soon. Bye, guys.